Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a question that many data enthusiasts encounter when working with pandas and SQL databases. Our viewer is trying to write a data frame with multi-index columns to an MS SQL database, but they're facing an issue where the index gets output as null. Let's dive into the details and see how we can help. All right, guys, welcome back to another tech video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Now, don't forget to say just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you'll get to that resolution. Anyway, on to the video, cheers. To address the issue of writing a data frame with multi-index columns to an MS SQL database, we first need to understand how Pandas handles multi-index. In your case, the data frame is created with multi-index columns, but when you write it to SQL, the index is output as null. This is a common issue. To properly write the data frame to SQL, you can reset the index before using the toSQL method. This will ensure that the index is included in the output. After resetting the index, the data frame will include the index as a regular column, which should resolve the null issue in your SQL database. Finally, always check the SQL table structure after writing to ensure that the data is stored correctly. This will help you confirm that the solution worked. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To handle multi-index columns in a pandas data frame, you can concatenate the first levels of your data frame. This allows you to prepare the data for SQL insertion. This method results in a table with repeated index values, which can be useful for certain SQL operations. For a more structured SQL table, you can use the merge function and add suffixes to each column. This keeps the data organized and clear. This approach gives you a well-structured SQL table with distinct column names, making it easier to work with the data. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. If you're dealing with a multi-index in pandas, you can flatten it using the two flat index method. First, set your data frames columns like this, df.columns equals df.columns.flatindex. Then, you can save your data frame to SQL with depth SQL, and the index will be written correctly. If you prefer more readable column names in SQL, you can join both levels of the multi-index. Use a list comprehension to create new column names by joining them with an underscore. After modifying, your columns might look like this, foo A, foo B, foo C, bar A, bar B, bar C. This makes your SQL output clearer. And that's it, guys. I hope you found the answer that you're looking for and got to that resolution in the end. If you did, please take a moment, hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. Until the next time you need more technical videos, I hope you have a great day. Cheers.